Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, can you please subscribe? And can you show me some love by liking this video? Today I am making shrimp boil. It is not low carb at all, but um, it is pretty good and I've been wanting it. So I have went to the store and got some things. I have two packages of the two pound shrimp raw. I have some frozen corn that's already cut up. I have this light brown sugar I had in the pantry, super hard, so I'm gonna work with it. Old Bay seasoning. Um, I've seen a lot of videos where they use like the whole head of garlic, but I'm just gonna use six cloves. Cajun seasoning, lemon and pepper seasoning, chili powder, I have no paprika, I thought I did. And then country crock butter and red potatoes. So I have a strainer, I'm gonna throw in the raw shrimp so I'm able to rinse it out. Then I'm getting some red potatoes so I can rinse them off and cut them up. I'm thinking about on this channel adding some recipes that are not low carb and just making sure I say it's not low carb or just changing my name. I'm not too sure yet. I rinse my potatoes. This is a five pound bag. I use more than half. And then I'm just gonna open up the corn. I have my water boiling in the back. And I'm just gonna do a quick rinse on these two. Okay, so I have three pots filled with water. I did add pink salt. I'm just gonna add a little chicken bouillon to it. Okay, I'm gonna add the corn in one. potatoes I'm just gonna cut them into fours okay, that one's not cute some are darker than the others but that's fine if they're small I'm just gonna barely cut them in half Now I'm gonna add my red potatoes. I'll probably boil them for 25 minutes to 30 minutes, depending on how soft they're getting. And this water's super hot, so I can't just throw them in there fast enough. And then I have my shrimp, and this will only take like five minutes for it to cook. Just do a quick stir. It's already turning pink. So it's been five minutes. The shrimp is already pink. So I'm gonna turn it off and drain out the water. I washed my strainer and put it in the sink. There goes my shrimp. I got my six cloves of garlic. I'm just gonna chop these up. Okay, 
That's all done. I have a small pot that I use for menudo. I did cover the potatoes back there. And now I'm gonna add the add in the butter and garlic first. I always have my names on the pots or Tupperware, just so if I go somewhere, I they return it to me. <laughs> so that's why my name's on it. Okay. I use about a little more than half of this three pound, two pound. Okay, now I'm gonna add in the garlic. Just gonna mix everything around. So I have one tablespoon and I have the obey. So now I have, I'm gonna use one tablespoon of the lemon pepper. You can add as much seasoning that you like. And now for one tablespoon of chili powder. I don't have paprika, so I'm just gonna use what I have. And my pot keeps moving because it's chueco from the bottom. Now I have the Cajun seasoning. I'm gonna add two of the Cajun. And then there's my second one. Okay. Now I just want to mix everything together. And since my brown sugar is old and dried, but it's not outdated, um, I just put three little chunks, so it's one tablespoon. And the brown sugar is supposed to make it a little bit thick. So I'm gonna add another tablespoon of the brown sugar. You don't have to do that. I'm just doing it because I just want it a little bit thicker and just a tad bit sweet, but it's not even sweet. I did chop my corn. I, I just let them cook for 20 minutes. And now I'm just gonna try out. If my potatoes are a little soft. Okay, I'm gonna chop my potatoes also. And they've been cooking for 25 minutes. Don't want them too soft, obviously. Okay. That's how that looks. I put it on low and so I'm now gonna add in my shrimp. I'm gonna drain my corn. And I'm gonna add it into the pot. So hot. And now I'm gonna do the same thing with the potatoes. Now I'm gonna stir it all around, or try to. Okay. So it's very hard to stir, so I'm just putting the pot and just putting it to the side. I did turn off the heat. I 
have a nine by 13 dish. I'm gonna see how much will fit in here. So this is my nine by 13 dish and I still have a lot in the pot. It's not as spicy. I didn't have no pap paprika, but if you like paprika, if you like it spicy, add a lot of spice to this. So I have some parsley. I'm just gonna throw a little on top. I didn't have no sausage. Um, I was trying to look for it in the store and I couldn't find any, so I have no sausage. That's why there's none in here. And remember, if you guys like heat, add more seasoning that you like. You guys, thank you for watching. It is all done. I'm so happy I get to eat this today. And um, I will see you guys soon. Toodles.